Ian from Lean Media. Today, I'm going to be talking about the new USPS Ground Advantage shipping service and what it means for Shopify sellers. If this video helps you out, please take a moment to like it and follow me. Let's get going. On the USPS website and elsewhere online, uh, there's a new service available for small businesses who are shipping in the US. They're basically guaranteeing uh, two to five business days using ground shipping. Um, they ship to all 50 states, uh, territories, military bases, etc. It's a good option if you're shipping anything with uh, that's hazmat, so that would be like a chemical or lithium batteries or something like that. And then they have this pricing. Um, you know, pricing starts at 475, and if you go to the USPS website and look at their pricing chart, you can see how it works out. And basically, this service is replacing first class mail and priority mail for many types of sellers. Um, and you may be wondering as a Shopify seller, well, what does this mean for you? And I, I, I was wondering this myself. Um, and basically, let's see if I can find it here. Yeah, so this is my Shopify store, one of my Shopify stores. I've been selling on Shopify for more than five years. And today I went into my Shopify settings and wanted to see what the rates were for, um, for my options were for shipping via economy. So I have a I have a couple options here listed and I charge some money for it. And then usually what you can do is you can you can make some changes to the uh, to the services that are available. So for instance, I was looking at my edit rate and seeing how seeing what different types of options that I had. And basically it's not showing anything for ground advantage. And actually if you look at the rest of world it was even more pronounced. Um, like ground advantage isn't even an option here. They still have first class packages, media mail, parcel select, priority mail, but they don't have ground advantage. And when I went to look on uh, Shopify uh, forums to see what other people are selling, is seeing, and they're not seeing it either. So the long and short of it is, as of the summer of 2023, Shopify hasn't really said anything about this or rolled out anything for USPS Ground Advantage. Apparently, first class labels that you purchase, they'll still be valid until the end of September. So Shopify must be planning to switch over to USPS Ground Advantage, but they just haven't really told us what it will mean. Uh, there's a lot of frustration with the USPS Ground Advantage. Some people, they're, they're complaining that the uh, service is slower than what they had before, but I would like to point out that the ground advantage actually has a couple advantages over the the old method of shipping, and that would be if you're selling something that's under one pound, you'd use first class mail. If it's over one pound, you'd be using priority mail or U.S. Parcel Select. You know, here's my take on it. Let's take a look at the pricing list again. Um, so, let's say that you are selling something that weighs uh, one pound or one and a half pounds. In the old days, you couldn't even get first class packages uh, shipped via first class mail if it's over one pound. You'd be forced into getting priority mail. So here's the priority mail rate. And you can see like zone one, one over one pound, like one and a half pounds, or you round up to two pounds. You'd be paying like, you know, somewhere between nine and ten dollars in zone one. Now, if you're using the ground advantage rate, it's it's uh, not nearly as much. It's 760 or 850, depending on how uh, depending on how big it is for zone one. And I've also found if you're using a service like uh, ShipStation or some some other service that integrates with the USPS, they they have a they have some special rate that's applied as well. So you're paying less than less than the stated rate. So for instance, today I had a package shipped through another uh, through another company, 12 ounces. Zone five, and the official stated rate is six forty, but I paid like four dollars and eighty cents. So I'm pretty happy with that. The other advantage of this is that it includes not only tracking but also a hundred dollars worth of insurance. That was not possible before with first class mail unless you purchased it extra. So uh, I know that there's a lot of negative Nellies and Debbie Downers out there with with ground advantage and what it means for Shopify. But actually, in my opinion, it's this is this is a, a step up, not a step down. As for the complaints like, oh, this is this is uh, shorter than what they guaranteed before. It's like, come on, get real. First class mail was never, <laughs> never a super reliable, like always on time type of service. And I think that ground advantage is going to be basically, you know, except for stuff that might have been shipped uh, via an airplane before. I think that still it's it's still going to be okay in many cases. Um, you're getting a good rate. Yes, if you're shipping to the other side of the country, it's instead of being three days, it may be four or five days. But you know, let's be real here. People, uh, people, 
it, it costs it costs a lot of money to set up uh, air shipping. Uh, usually, what Shopify and other platforms want us to do is they want us to eat the cost of it. And I think that people have to understand, customers have to understand that if they want premium services like shipping within two or three days, they have to pay for it. What I would be doing right now if uh, you were running a Shopify business is be setting up uh, services. So if people are paying for something uh, that is that needs to be there as soon as possible, like you set up a premium level of shipping in your in your Shopify shipping settings and you make people pay for it. Because you basically, you have to, if they want it to be shipped in two or three days now, or even faster than that, they're going to have to be paying for Priority Mail or Priority Mail Express, and uh, your the cost should should uh, respect that. If it's a case where it's you're offering free U.S. ground shipping, in my case, is for anything that's fifty dollars or up, okay, yeah, they have to get a bigger order. Or if it's less than if it's less than fifty dollars, they have to pay a nominal price, two ninety nine or three ninety nine or four ninety nine or whatever. So. Um, I think that this is a this is uh, an improvement over what used to be the system, especially for packages that are over one pound. I like having the insurance included, even for packages that are under one pound. A hundred dollars of insurance. Yes, there are some quirks with the pricing, um, based not only on this chart, but for instance, if things are a little bit bigger, like let's say you're shipping, I don't know, like a. Uh, some long item that in, from your Shopify business that's longer than 22 inches but shorter than 30 inches. You have to pay a surcharge on top of that $4. But these are things, quirks that people will be able to work out. I do like Shopify. I hope that Shopify can get its um, integration and statements about what this means for sellers. I'm kind of surprised nothing has really turned up on this. And if you look on the Shopify forums, people are talking about it and complaining about it. But if I were Shopify, I would get a statement out about this, like when they're going to integrate all of this stuff with Shopify stores and be sure to let people know what this means. In some cases, for people that um, have very time sensitive shipping schedules, you may need to change your shipping settings to reflect uh, reflect that to let people know that, yes, it may take longer than before. Or if people want, if, cu if your customers want to get some premium service, they're going to have to, uh, instead of getting ground advantage, they're going to have to pay for Priority Mail or Priority Mail Express. And it may be very expensive, like Priority Mail Express. Check this out. Zone one for a half for a half pound, <laughs> $28.75. That's not a cost that most Shopify sellers can eat. So you're going to have to change your shipping settings in Shopify. Uh, so the people that want fast service, they're going to have to pay for it. And people that are okay with getting something in two to five days, which I think is most of the population, okay, they'll get an economy level of service. Maybe they'll have to pay a little bit extra. That's the way I've set up, set up my Shopify shipping for if it's less than $50 purchase, they have to pay $2.99 on top of that for the uh, ground shipping. If they, if they get a big order, $50 or more, they get free ground shipping, and it's going to be ground advantage shipping. I hope this helped kind of clear things up a little bit with uh, Shopify. I know that the, perch, the picture is still a little bit murky, in part because Shopify hasn't yet integrated with ground advantage or its uh, shipping settings need to be updated, but I expect that to take place later this summer of 2023. Uh, if this video helped you out, please take a moment to like it and follow me. And if you go to leanmedia.org, that's my official website, uh, click on blog or video or search for Shopify and you'll see I have tons of blog posts and video resources about using Shopify, for instance, easy way to set up free shipping and Shopify, etc. This is Ian signing off. Thank you so much for watching.